So, you want to be a pilot, huh? Okay. You finally made it. A major airline has hired you after all those sacrifices and hard work. Here is something you ought to know. Advancement in the aviation industry centers around hours flown and seniority. That means all those ships no one wants are gleefully yours. You may have to fly out of your base in Minneapolis, Minnesota while you're living in Boston, Massachusetts. And that means a lot of travel time just to get to and from work. On Christmas, New Year's, Easter, Independence Day, Labor Day, and Thanksgiving, you're on the plane. This job distances you from your family and friends. You do want to keep a healthy diet and be in good physical condition and make sure you don't consume any alcohol in the day you fly. And of course, you don't want to use drugs either. Be mindful that each time you're piloting the plane, you are giving a performance and your passengers are judging you. The airline that hired you puts all of its confidence in you. You are flying machinery that is worth tens of millions of dollars and XYZ Airlines expects you to keep that aircraft in excellent condition. Your responsibility is enormous. If you survive a crash, all attention will be immediately focused on you and you have to prove your innocence by demonstrating you followed all the necessary procedures. If you're blamed for the mishap, consequences are pretty serious. Since you watched this video all the way to the end, Captain Cartwright and myself can give you great recommendations for flight schools. All you gotta do is ask for them in the description box.